I'm told you got absolutely drenched earlier on, mate. <laughs> yes, Mark. I came out here to put my uh, signs out here, and just uh, walking down from the car, I. Uh, I got heavily drenched, <laughs> and to even... the extent I had to get changed. Now, they say that uh, there are horses suited to wet tracks. You're not one of them, are you? Well, I am. I'm, I'm, I'm used to heavy tracks, Mark, <laughs> but, uh, you know, the clothing sometimes need to be changed. Yeah. What, are, what are the locals at Yarralumla talking about? Well, the issues are pretty, pretty much the same in most areas, not just in Yarralumla. Uh, people are concerned about the rising cost of living, the fact that... Uh, the rates are going up and you know we keep reminding people that we we were told we were liars uh, four years ago and what we said about the rates tripling in eight years is pretty well on track yeah and um, that's one of the issues um, the the indiscriminate development that this government's trying to do is also one of the issues in just about every one of the inner south and inner north suburbs where people in these areas are intelligent well-connected people but they and they're not anti-development but they're anti the absolute stupidity that is being applied to some of the, the planning um, so-called innovation where population densities are trying to be put into the suburban areas. Now, uh, according to the Canberra plan, yeah, population density needs to be built up in some of the, the town centres. But, you know, little shopping centres like Yarralumla, Red Hill, these would be totally destroyed by the sort of development the government has tried to do here at the Brickworks, for instance. So th these are the sort of issues that affect most of the people that I speak to. And how welcome is the rain for you? It's very nice. <laughs> I mean, after temperatures of 34 to 38 degrees, I think this is fantastic. We need the rain, so I don't mind getting changed a few times a day, Mark, if, uh, if we get this sort of weather.